during the process of selling this person's house, she was going through a divorce, and um, she confided in me that she was considering suicide. Oh, no. So as a real estate agent, I'm just like a bartender. People right. tell me everything. So I'm intimately involved in people's lives for four months in a in most intense mm -hmm. personal way you can imagine. And they tell me everything. And so you remember when I told you that the professor told me that I would not make a good pastoral counselor? Yes. So he was right. Uh -huh. Because I take on that, that burden. stuff. Yep. And so she unloaded that onto me. Oh, my goodness. And I took it in and allowed her to take it off of herself. Hmm. And I came home to Peter and just fell apart. And yeah. I mean, I could get choked up talking about it. Yeah, him. yeah. <clears throat> just um, people's pain. Real estate is, um, it's not just a financial purchase. It's mm -hmm. people are going through a very personal experience. They're either getting married, getting divorced, having a baby. Mm. Someone's died. Mm. So they're, you know, upsizing because they're having lots more children than they anticipated or they're downsizing because their children are empty nesters. But these are all very emotional experiences. And I have a gift, a curse of empathy, and I can get, I can share that experience with them and feel their pain and help hold that, that pain or hmm. joy with them as they go through the process. And But they don't understand is that they've left an indelible mm -hmm. mark on my DNA after they've gone on. Yep. Um, but people all along the way have touched my life mm -hmm. in profound ways that, you know, sometimes they will never know.